Welcome everyone. Your iPad screen may not be responding to touch. So in my case, if I swipe, it's working for me. But for you, touch screen simply is not working. Power button not working. So what do you do? Well, the solution is we're gonna initiate a force restart. Doing a force restart is quite simple. I'm gonna show you the key combination first, then let's do it together. So the key combination is you're gonna click and release volume up, then you're gonna click and release volume down, then you're gonna click and hold the power button and you're gonna keep it held down until you see the Apple logo. So if you need extra time to get your iPad ready, just pause the video, then come back. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get ready and I'm gonna start in three, two, one. Click release volume up, click release volume down, click another power button, keep this one held down. So in your case, you will not see this slide the power off menu because your iPad screen is frozen. Uh, of course I do because it's not frozen. If you accidentally release the power button at any time before the screen goes black, then you have to repeat the process. When you see the Apple logo, you can release your finger from the power button. If you, this didn't work for you, then simply put, you didn't do the key combination correctly. The timing for how you click the, the volume buttons here is very strict. Uh, so I recommend is you rewind the video and you do the key combination exactly how I do it. And once you've done that, your iPad's gonna be on the lock screen. And when you go back to the home screen, uh, the screen should be responding to touch and there should be no more issues. So with that being said, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.